What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Ethan and Keith, the Batman up in here for you, recording for you today on, what's today's day? Today is what? What, 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 what? Today is the, what, 6th? No, 5th, 8th, 5th, June 5th. And I'm recording this by 8 o'clock, you guys, for y'all, because today, I wanted to do this earlier. I wanted to do this video earlier, but I had to do a few things earlier today, and it just came in for me, but I couldn't do anything yet, because like I said, that do so good. Kingdom Hearts, man. The Kingdom Hearts. Yeah, you already know I have Kingdom Hearts 3. And I beat it. You know, yeah, to me, I have mixed feelings from, um, you know, Kingdom Hearts 3. I really, really have mixed feelings for that game. Like, the only thing I really love about that game, or well, two things I love about that game, is the graphics. And then the combat of the game. That's it. Other than that, I think it's a little faster paced combat than the original um, Kingdom Hearts. But other than that, I really hate the story. I'm being honest with you. Now, I'm not really wrong. You know, the last, and we'll see every Kingdom Hearts, the story is just, like, really, like, what the hell? Like, you don't know what's going on in Kingdom Hearts, to be honest. But this, like, Kingdom Hearts 3, feel like it was just a lazy story. Not, not just lazy, I just feel like when you play Kingdom Hearts 3, when you had a Disney character, I just feel like it was just side quests to me. Like, and, and I was really disappointed. Not like this, that you had the Disney characters more. Like, it, it felt like they belong in the story. And it, it, there were... There was a that was connected to the story that should be in Kingdom Hearts 3 that wasn't connected. I feel like it was just a lazy thing. Um, I feel like it was just like, hey, you want to do this before you get to them? Because after you beat the whole entire um, in Kingdom Hearts 3, the whole Disney characters that uh, are in there, can't tell you, I don't want to spoil it. Even if you already know, you already know. Then then you feel like you're really playing the campaign to it. That's, that's how I felt. Here, Kingdom Hearts, I finally got the Kingdom Hearts, the remastered one. Uh, 1.5 plus the 2.5 edition, the final ones, uh, the HD one, of course. I didn't get the whole big collection. I didn't want to get all that because I didn't really care about the rest of the DS games. Because I, really, I wasn't fond about the most of the games. But this one has Kingdom Hearts 1, 2, and like, four other ones that I don't know are in here. But I really wanted this, man. I really wanted this. And the reason why I wanted this and the reason why I wanted to make this video for y'all is because I really, really have a chance to this game. And uh, especially from Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2. That I played it for the PS2, and like I have a long history then. And, and this, this honestly, I gotta say this. Remember, I told y'all before in big crazy videos that I got a handful of games that I kind of burned out. Like I literally will play consistently. Well, this is one of them. Literally, one and two was consistently one of those games that I consistently play every single day. Whether it's the WWE games or you know what I'm saying, like the other handful of games, I will always put time on Kingdom Hearts 22. And even though I was struggling in Kingdom Hearts too, because at that time, for me it was challenging, it was hard. But you know, you know, I took, you know, beat it. it took me a while, but I still beat it. I, I really wanted to go back with, with it, especially with Sephiroth and all that stuff. I used to love those, those side quest bosses that Kingdom Hearts don't three don't have. Oh man, Kingdom Hearts three, man. I waited too long for what? But anyway, I didn't really care. I really wanted to get. This. I remember when this game was already announced. I really wanted to get this game. But there was a few games that kind of pushed me away from this game. And I, I don't quite remember what games were it. But I remember buying those games because I have them on my on my collection already. On my physical copy collection. And it kind of pushed me away from it. And lately, for the last few months, and as you can see in my previous video, I, you know, I got the games that I already bought this year. That I finally got out the way. And now I finally had the opportunity to say, hey, we're going to look for this copy. And I actually got a great deal on this game. Literally, um, yes, I got to use, but seriously, this game was in perfect condition. Like I feel like you can open it, and it had the smell, like a brand new smell. Like you know, when you open the game, first opening, you have that smell. Like I said before, yeah, it did. And guess how much I paid for this game? Fifteen bucks, fifteen dollars just for a game that's practically new. You know, it was open to be as used. I know once you open it to use game, I get that, but. For me, it was a brand new game. For me, it felt like it was just not having been touched at all. Look at the finger, there was no fingerprints, no scratches, nothing. It was literally a perfect game for 15 bucks, and I was so happy because I, I was willing to still pay full price to be honest with y'all. But I you know, I looked in eBay and I actually saw a perfect person that was willing to sell it. He, he was gonna sell it for 25 and I was still gonna buy it, but I said, hey, why not try 15, see what happens? And I was some lucky person to get this for fifteen dollars guys and as you can see it's already on my console that ain't on my console already yeah, this game i was talking about right here 
I really didn't want it because it's the rest of the DS, you know, the three DS games or DS games. I really care about it. I really care about this because one and two was was really one of my favorite games of all times, and definitely, like I said, I have a long history with, with um, Kingdom Hearts one and two. Like you don't understand it, and I'm gonna, I wanted to stream. I probably will stream tonight, and if I don't, I'm sorry. I kind of got into the game where I wanted to play it, but it's finally here. I'm finally going to play it, guys. I'm happy as hell because I'm a true Kingdom Hearts fan, and and, and I hate when people say, "Oh, you Kingdom Hearts fan? Why you got all the Kingdom Hearts game?" It, no, man. I really do love one and two, and I definitely love how they use the characters and Disney characters they have in here, like Simba, and you know. All the other like uh success like Simba, Sephiroth, Cloud is in this in this game. Like, oh my god, it's, it's it it was meant to be what it's meant to be, and it's perfect. It was fitting away for me, and I loved it. And Kingdom Hearts three, yeah, I was disappointed, man. I'm I'm really I, like I liked it, but then again, yeah, but this right here, this game right here, never disappointed me. I kind of wish they had the comeback from kept the combat the. The gameplay combat fight things on on Kimo Street into this. Man, that'd be dope, guys. But yes, I finally got my copy. I got it for a great price. And nowadays I'm just patient and I take my time buying games. I, I literally I used to be one of those kids back, especially when the generation, the last generation, the Xbox 360 PC. I will always buy every game. If it's trash and I will buy it. But now I'm picky when it comes to my games and literally I you know, I really wanted to get this for full price. I didn't care. Because I already wanted this game, period. But to, to, to know that I only paid 15 bucks and it was a perfect deal, got a shit. It, and I bought this two days ago, guys. Two. two. And it came in today. Today. I, I put that right in, make the PS4, let it install, and bam. That's where you finished stalling, waiting for me to play the game. You know how it goes, guys. You know how it goes, YouTube. Anyway, guys, I'm happy. I finally got the game. I want to play it. I ain't going to stream some of it. I don't know if I'm going to do the beginning. Or if I'm gonna do it, you know, in one of the places where I save and I finally start doing it, I don't know yet. I've already decided it's already in my game right now. Um, I just wanted to record this to y'all because I did say the day that I get this game, I'm gonna show y'all that I got it because I'm really, really happy and fun about this because this is literally one of my favorite games, and especially as a little kid when I was younger. And I'm happy to have it now, guys. So it's here, guys. It is here. I know I'm late. I know I'm late. You don't have to rub my face in the comments and say, oh, you do late, Ethan, oh, 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 oh. you should have been got the game, but whatever, I don't care. I got it now, I'm going to play it, all right? So, I'll make more videos later on down the road. Uh, I probably, as we speak right now, as I'm recording this to you, I might do another recording, but it won't be with me. It will probably be with my little cousins. They want to do a little something for y'all. If you like it, hey, why not? Hey, it's just that I'm, I'm a family person. I, I don't mind sharing with them. If they want to show y'all something, appreciate whatever it is that they got, leave a like for me, please, and comment for them. You know what I mean? They, they need a little support, too. They like this. They like doing what I like to do, too. You know, to perform for you, YouTube guys. So I hope you watch this. Please leave a like, comment on what's your favorite Kingdom Hearts game out of the whole series, and let me know what you feel. Like, how do you feel for Kingdom Hearts 3, if you have it or not, or have you played it or not? Let me know how you feel about that. Come on. I, I need your, your your point of view because it kind of gave you my eyes. And I'm not, I wasn't so happy about finding about it. Like I said, story to me was lazy. And gameplay-wise, good graphics. Bonita. I know. It was good. But other than that, I just wasn't really happy. Like, I was really disappointed at the ending, too. But, you know, hey, uh, this didn't point me. I played one and two of those. I'm glad I have it. I'm happy. I got it for a great price. Anyway, like, subscribe, comment, whatever. Do what you want. I hope you watched it. I hope you enjoyed this boring little, you know, that I'm doing for y'all. But anyway, like I said, I'll be in the next video soon. Uh, for my little cousins, as y'all saw in the last previous videos I did. My two little cousins, y'all already know who they are. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching this. Appreciate it. And I'll get back to y'all later. Deuces.